Aaron, do you think that final cold strike on Donaldson was out of the zone? Up? I, I mean, I, I got to look at it. Um, what'd you say? I, I haven't looked. It's a little high, but maybe I just looked at it on replay. Yeah, it looked like he snatched it down and seemed high, but I haven't looked at it yet. Overall, the offense, one for 12 with runners in scoring position. What do you think the difference was for Orioles pitching tonight that they weren't able to get that big hit? Yeah, I mean, you know, that's that's frustrating. We, we, you know, we had chances to really pull away, and um, you know, I, we, ton of traffic, a lot of good at bats up and down the lineup, but just not able to break through or you get that big extra base hit and that, with with guys on base, whatever it may be. We had our chances tonight and, and just couldn't put it away. Cole seemed pretty animated after that sixth inning. Was he pleading his case to, to stay in, or were you always sending him out there for the seventh with that pitch count already? I think at a hundred and yeah, ten. just just where we were in our pen and. He was just reaffirming, like, like let's go, yeah. So, um, yeah, so he wasn't pleading his case necessarily. He was just more like, I'm good, let's go, and, um, you yeah, know, that's all we needed. It was all unavailable tonight. I think guessing Peralta, Chapman, others also? Oh, yeah, yeah. I mean, we were down to, you know, <clears throat> for tonight, um, after Green, there was, you know, I, I had Clark, so – and just kind of holding him in case, you know, we got in a situation obviously close where we needed a few innings and, and we're going to run. So, uh, yeah, we were, we were pretty short tonight. You had mentioned before the game that you thought Peralta would maybe be an option, that he was on the other side of the back issue. What told you otherwise? We we're, were just treating him as an emergency day. We were encouraged by what, what he was able to do pregame from his flat ground and playing catch and stuff. But, um uh, he would have been an emergency. So, you know, beyond Clark, you know, I, I would have used Peralta before a position player, for example. But, um, you know, so today was an encouraging day. Do you think the, I mean, the heat, hundred that was like 97 degrees, does that affect Cole at all? And I don't think so. No, I, I thought, in, in fact, I thought kind of after a few innings that, that breeze picked up a little bit and it felt like it cooled it off a little bit. I thought he was in good good shape going out. I thought his stuff was still good there uh, in the seventh inning. Um, you know, left a pitch uh, with, with two strikes, got to Arias there and left a little bit in. But still, you know, he just kind of dumps it in a perfect spot there. And then I thought he executed against Mateo. Good, looked like a good slider down the way that he breaks his bat on for the, for the base hit. So, um, no, I thought he was sound and, and and really, after kind of working hard the first two innings where they were fouling off a ton of pitches, so driving his pitch count up and making him work, I thought I thought he kind of settled into a pretty good rhythm and place, um, you know, as the night went on. How concerned are you about your bullpen? I know it's been very good all year, but you lost some guys and some high leverage guys have been struggling. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll get it going. Um, you know, last couple of days just, just with, you know, doubleheader and usage, you know, a little bit up against it, but uh, we'll get it going. We got the talent down there to, to do that. Do you expect another move or two before tomorrow? Um, maybe another move. Or not sure. Possibly. We'll, we'll see. Uh, we'll go meet on that now.